A violent offender is off the streets in Portsmouth thanks to the statewide initiative Operation Cease Fire. 35 year old Danny Collins is now serving time for having illegal guns and earlier Michelle Wolf spoke with Virginia's Attorney General about the program's impact on crime and how he's working to take back the community. Operation Ceasefire was launched in late 2022 to tackle gun violence with rigorous prosecution and community prevention. We're going to prosecute. We're going to hold you accountable. We set it up in 12 targeted cities uh, across Virginia that had particularly uh, high levels of gun violence. Norfolk and Portsmouth are two of those 12 cities that we targeted. Attorney General Jason Meares tells us the initiative has already sparked 19 convictions and 81 pending indictments. Our goal is to go after those violent repeat offenders. There's multiple studies that have shown roughly three to five percent of felons are committing over 50 percent of the violent crime. The RS says Danny Collins of Portsmouth was a repeat offender who was observed by federal agents selling illegal drugs from his vehicle. Portsmouth police found cocaine, crack cocaine, marijuana, two firearms and ammunition in his car. Since participating in ceasefire, Portsmouth Mayor Shannon Glover says the city's homicide numbers have gone down in the past year. Everybody is responsible for helping to maintain safety and security in the city. If folks are not willing to change their habits and behaviors and want to continue to threaten folks in the community, removing them is critical. Glover is taking the statewide initiative one step further with the city's own program, which just launched on Tuesday, called Portsmouth United. Those grassroots organizations, those violence interrupters, uh, mental health professionals, all those folks are sitting down at the table bringing their best ideas and best practices to improve in the area of intervention and prevention. Portsmouth United is a collaboration of federal, state, and local resources to not only fight crime, but give those who want help the means to better themselves. In Portsmouth, Michelle Wolfton on your side.